health lesson eight. Thanks for joining us for our health lesson. Can everyone say hello? Hello. <laughs> Let's start with our meditation. We're going to think about heart center. We're going to use two fingers to find our heart center. Left hand in our lap. And we're going to close our eyes. Close your eyes. When you feel your heartbeat or your pulse or boom, 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 you can move your right hand into your lap. But keep thinking about your heart center. Keep your eyes closed. Keep breathing slowly. Let's end our meditation with three breaths together. One, two, and three. Slowly wiggle your fingers. Slowly wiggle your toes. Slowly open your eyes. Slowly stand up. <laughs> Good. Let's stretch our arms way up into the sky. Go up on your toes. Good. Let's make a T so we can ta -ta touch our toes. Come up halfway. Swing your monkey arms. Good job, let's stand up straight and tall. Let's do it again, let's stretch our arms up high. What letter are we making? I, 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 Good job. What letter are we making? O, ah, ah, octopus. What letter? U, U, ah, ah, umbrella. What letter? A, A, ah, ah, apple. What letter? C. C. Ka, ka, ka. What letter? K. K. Ka, ka, king. Good. Same sound. All right. T. Ta, ta, train. And ta, ta, touch your toes. Good. Come up halfway. Monkey arms. Swing those monkey arms all around. Ooh, 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 ah, ah. You can make some nice monkey sounds. Then come up nice and tall. We're going to stand up nice and tall. We're going to practice growing. Make a small little ball. I see you. I see you. I see you all. We're going to grow. We're going to grow. We're going to grow. Good. Let's do it again. Small little ball. I see everyone. We're gonna grow. We're gonna grow. We're gonna grow. Good job. Let's do it one more time. Make a small little ball. We're gonna grow. We're gonna grow. We're gonna grow. Good job. Say hello to your neighbor. Hello. 
Shake hands with your neighbor. Give your neighbor a high five. Good job. Let's spin around three times. One, two, three. Ooh. Everybody can take a seat. In this lesson, we're going to be reviewing some of our past health lessons. So we'll be reviewing hand washing, posture, and different items of clothing. So we have a few activities to do for each of these today. <laughs> so we're going to review hand washing with our PowerPoint. Mm -hmm. First thing we do, what do we put on our hands? Water. Water. We put water on our hands. And this, yeah, and that makes them wet. Wet. Yeah, wet. Wet. Wuh, wuh, wet. What, what letter does wet start with? W. W. Good job. So when we put water on our hands, that makes them wet. Wet. That's the first thing we do. Put water on our hands. The second thing we do. We put soap on our hands. Yeah, we put soap on our hands. Very good. First thing we do, put water on our hands. Second thing we do is what? Put soap on our hands. Put soap on our hands. The third thing we do. Yeah. We. Wow. Good job. Yeah. We rub our hands. Everybody, show me. Rub your hands. Rub your hands. We rub our hands for about five seconds, so that we can make what? Four. <laughs> yeah. We want to make bubbles. We rub our hands so we can make some bubbles. 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 What sound do you hear in bubbles? Mm -hmm. There's a lot of bu bu bubble sounds. Good job. So we rub our hands to make bubbles. The fourth thing we do, we use water again to do what? Rinse. Good. To rinse our hands. Rinse our hands. Rinse our hands. Good. We use water to rinse our hands. Water. And this takes off the soap. Take off the soap. Yeah, this takes the soap off our hands so that we don't have any more soap on our hands. Good job. Another thing we do, we do what? Duh. Duh. Dry. Dry our hands. Good job. We can use a towel to dry our hands. Sometimes I just dry them on my skirt <laughs> if there's no towel. Towel. Let me hear. Towel. 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 Yeah, we can use a towel to dry our hands. We can also give our hands a shake like that. Yeah, we can shake our hands. Or sometimes we can just do that. <laughs> Good job. Okay, let's take a look at the steps for washing our hands. Can you help me remember what the steps for washing our hands? What's the first thing we put on our hands? What's the first thing we put on our hands? Water. Good job. We put water on our hands. What letter does hand start with? Good. N D S. Good. Second thing, we put something else on our hands. Yeah, what is it? We put soap on our hands. What is soap? Help 
me spell our hands. when we rub our hands? What do we make? Bubbles. bubbles. We make bubbles when we rub our hands. After we rubbed our hands, we want to get the soap off. How do we get the soap off? We rinse our hands. What letter does rinse start with? Good job. Rin. N. Rinse. And there's a silent E on there. We rinse our hands. Help me spell oh, our hands. You, you are in we rinse our hands. Good job. Dry our and then we dry our hands. We dry our hands. What letter does dry start with? D. Second thing, put soap on our hands. Number three, rub our hands. Show me rub our hands. Good job. Number four, rinse our hands. And number five, dry our hands. Great job. Okay, we're gonna review a little bit of our posture on the PowerPoint, about our posture. Standing up nice and tall, our posture. Everybody stand up. Show me some good posture, nice and tall, nice and straight back. Good job. Look at our PowerPoint over here. Who do you think looks like they have good posture? The first person or the second person? First or the second? Second. Yeah, the second person. They look more comfortable. They're standing up nice and tall. Yeah. Yeah, they're nice and straight back. They look more comfortable. Good. Let's practice making our back nice and straight. So bend over a little bit. Hang like you have your monkey arms going on. Hang like you have your monkey arms. And then we're going to roll your back up slowly so that your back is nice and straight. Just like this lady. Let's do it again. Bend over like you have your monkey arms going. And you're going to roll your back up nice and straight so you're standing up tall. Good job. And then we're standing up nice and straight. We have good posture. Remember, when we do good posture, what do we want to do with our chin? Chin up. Chin up. What about our shoulders? Shoulders back. Feet flat. And our feet flat. Good job. We want our chin up. Shoulders back. Feet flat. Good. Shoulders back. Chin up. Shoulders back. Feet flat. Shoulders back. Chin up. Feet flat. Chin up. Shoulders back. Feet flat. Shoulders back. Chin up. Good job, friends. Okay. And when we sit down, everybody can take a seat. We still want to think about those three things. We still want our chin up. We still want our shoulders back. And we still want our feet flat. So while we're sitting, so me chin up. Shoulders back. Feet flat. Shoulders back. Chin up. Shoulders back. Chin up. Feet flat. Shoulders back. Feet flat. Shoulders back. Chin up. Feet flat. Shoulders back. Feet flat. Good job. I think you got it.
Okay. Yeah. Does anybody remember our little song we have about posture? We're going to go through it together. Remember, it's with numbers. One, two, you know what to do. Good. Three, four, feet flat on the floor. Good, let's say it again. Let's practice this part. Just one, two, you know what to do. Three, four, feet flat on the floor. Good, feet flat. Feet flat. On the floor. Feet flat. Feet flat. On the floor. Good job. Let's go through it again. We'll keep going. We're going to go again and then we'll keep going. One, two. You know what to do. Three, four. Feet flat on the floor. Five, six. Chin up quick. Seven, eight. Stand up straight. Good. Let's do five and six again. Five, six, chin up quick, seven, eight, stand up straight. Good job. Let's do all of these again and then we'll do nine and ten. One, two, you know what to do. Three, four, feet flat on the floor. Five, six, chin. I think we're gonna move on. I think everybody's got it. So we're gonna move on to practicing a little bit of activity or practicing a little bit of posture in this next balancing activity. In this activity, we're going to use a book to practice good posture. So first we're going to try to sit with the book on our head. We're going to do sitting and standing and then we're gonna try to walk around with the book on our head. Okay. So remember, for our good posture, what do we want with our chin? What do we want with our chin? Do we want our chin down? No. Where? Chin up. Chin up. What about our shoulders? Shoulders back. Shoulders back. What about our feet? Feet flat. Feet flat. Good job. Everybody, take your book. Try to balance it on your head. See if you can hold it on your head while you're sitting. See if you can sit with that book balanced on your head. You have to have your chin up and your shoulders back and your feet flat to be able to do it. All right. Takes a little bit of practice. <laughs> so see if you can sit for a few minutes with the book on your head. If you can sit with the book on your head, that's okay if it falls off. That's no problem. Just put it back on and try again. If you can sit with the book on your head, see if you can turn your head and say hello to your neighbor. Hello. See if you can turn your head and say hello to your neighbor. <laughs> That's a little bit harder. See if you can turn your head. <laughs> Hi. Hello. Yeah. <laughs> a little bit faster. <laughs> See if you can turn your head. Good job. Hello. Good job, hello. <laughs> Good, it's a little tricky, it takes some balance. It can help if you have your chin up, your shoulders back, and your feet nice and flat. Good job. Try to balance that book on your head while you're sitting down. 
Mm -hmm. Good. Let's practice that for one more minute. Try to keep the book on your head while you're sitting. Try to turn your head. Try to turn your head while you're sitting. Try to turn your head while you're sitting. See if you can count to 10. Sitting down and keeping the book on your head without falling off. <laughs> Good job. Okay. If you can hold the book. <laughs> Good job. <laughs> Good job. <laughs> Oh, close. That's okay. That's okay. Hello. 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 Good job. Okay. If you can balance that book on your head while you're sitting, try to stand up and sit down a few times. See if you can stand up with that book on your head. And you can sit down and keep that book on your head. You can go slow, try to stand up and try to sit down a few times. <laughs> it's a little bit harder to try to stand up and try to sit down. Good, you still want your chin up? You still want your shoulders back? And you wanna keep your feet flat? And that can help you balance. Have nice posture and stand up. Good job. It looks like a lot of our <laughs> looks like a lot of our friends are doing great. So try that a few times on your own. You can go as slow or as fast as you need to. Try to stand up and sit down a few times. See if you can stand up or sit down. You can go very slow. You can go very slow, or you can go very fast, or you can go very fast. Try at your own pace, whatever is good for you. All right. <laughs> good job. Try to stand up and sit down a few times. <laughs> That's a little bit trickier. Good job. So you can stand up a few times, sit down a few times. You can stand up a few times and sit down a few times. Good job. Great job. OK. See if you can stand with the book on your head. See if you can stand with the book on your head. Try to count to 10 with the book on your head, standing. That's a long time. Good job. Okay, if you can, ooh, <laughs> if you can stand with that book on your head for 10 seconds. Good job, you're doing a great job. I think we're gonna try to walk around a little bit. See if you can walk around with that book on your head. See if you can walk around a little bit with that book on your head. <laughs> we want our shoulders back. We want our chin up. That's gonna help us balance the book and have good posture. So take a few walks around. Take a little walk around. See if you can keep that book on your head by standing up nice and tall. Stand up nice and tall. Keep that book balanced on your head. Good job. Remember, we want to keep our chin up. 
our shoulders back and keep our feet flat when we walk around. Good. Let's try to take one lap around our desks. Let's see if we can take one lap around our desk. If your book falls off, that's okay. If your book falls off, that's okay. Good job, friends. Yeah, you're doing great. If your book falls off, that's okay. Just pick it back up and put it on your head. You can go slowly. You can go a little faster, whatever works for you. <laughs> if your book falls off, just pick it back up and put it on your head. <laughs> Good job. Good job. <laughs> All right. Ooh, I don't hear any books falling. Good job. <laughs> Remember, we want to keep our chin up and our shoulders back and our feet flat. Okay, everybody, find your way back to your desk. Yeah, we're going to do a little bit of review about our different kinds of clothes. 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 Good job. One thing we wear on our feet. What are they? Shoes. Shoes. Good job. Shoes. Another thing we wear on our feet. Socks. We wear socks on our feet. Socks. 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 Do we put our socks on over our shoes? No. No. We put our socks on what? On our feet. On our feet. We put our socks on our feet. Socks on the feet. <laughs> socks in the shoes. Yep. Good job. What are these? Shorts. shorts. They're shorts. 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 Everybody make the shorts. sound. Shorts. Good job. Shorts. Shorts. Raise your hand if you are wearing shorts today. Who's wearing shorts today? You're wearing shorts today? All right. I see them. Raise your hand if you're wearing shorts today. Cool. Shorts. Next we have pants. Pants. Pants are like long shorts. They go all the way down to our ankles. Long pants. Raise your hand if you are wearing pants today. <laughs> We've got a few friends wearing pants today. You're wearing pants. Are like long shorts, they go all the way down to our ankles. Let me hear pants. 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 What sound does pants start with? P. Letter P. Great job. Another thing we wear skirt. 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 Raise your hand if you are wearing a skirt today. Me. All right. Raise your hand if you're wearing a skirt today. <laughs> Good job. Another thing we wear on the top part of our body. Anybody have any ideas? What's another thing we wear on the top part of our body? Shirt. Shirt. That's right. We wear a shirt. Shirt. Let me hear. That's our sound for shirt. Shirt. Good. We have another kind of shirt here in the middle that's what color? Red. Red. We call this a t-shirt. A t-shirt. Because it looks a little bit like a letter T. Raise your hand if you are wearing a t-shirt today. All right. We have a lot of friends wearing a t-shirt today. Yeah. Am I wearing a t-shirt today? Am I wearing a t-shirt today? No. I'm not wearing a t-shirt. Good job. Another thing we can wear 
A dress. A dress. Dress. Am I wearing a dress today? I'm wearing a dress today. It's a blue dress. Yeah, it looks like that dress. How funny. <laughs> How funny. Good job. Okay, we're going to play a little matching game to review our clothing. Okay, we're going to play a little matching game. We have some pictures and we have some words to match with them. So first we're going to review our pictures really fast and then we'll try to review our words. What is this? Dress. 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 What is this? T-shirt. T-shirt. Good. What is this? Socks. 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 Shirt. Shorts. 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 Good job. Shorts. Pants. Pants. Great job. Skirt. Skirt. Great job. Shoes. Good. Shoes. Great job. Shirt. Shirt. <laughs> Great job. Okay. Let's take a look at some of our words. Dress. 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 Good. T-shirt. 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 Good. Socks. 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 Good. Shorts. Our SH sound. Shorts. 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 Good. Pants. Pants. Those are like long shorts all the way down to our ankles. Skirt. 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 Good job. We have what sound here? Shoes. Shoes. Good, because we have our SH sound that makes the sh sound. Shoes. Shoes. We have another SH sound. Shirt. 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 Good job. Okay. Good, it says dress. So we're going to play a matching game where some students are going to get words, some students will get pictures, and when I say go, you're going to find your partner and you're going to hold your match up in the air. What is this? What does this say? Is this a match? No. So I need to look around, find a partner who has my match. Okay, here we go. Oh my gosh. You want a word? Okay. Actually, hold on, let me give you a word next time. Sorry, we're gonna keep it this way so that it's rememberable. Oh, whoops, sorry. Okay. Everybody stand up. Look at your word or picture and go. You can go back to your desk when you have your dress. Good job. Socks. And shirt. Good job, everybody. Back to your desk. Did you have a word or picture last time? Word. Word? OK, picture this time. Picture. Word. Picture. Word. Picture. Word. Picture, word. Okay, find your partner. Find your partner. What is that? Dress. Dress. Socks. T-shirt. T-shirt. Shirt. Good job, friends. Great job.
And then one more time. Thanks for joining us for our health lesson review. Can everyone say goodbye? Bye.